Well, we have the most perfect day for you. A warm hello in every sense of the word. The sun is out and football has a special place on this most idyllic of days. A fixture ahead of us to which we've all been looking forward for so very, very long. And it means so very, very much. The scene could not be more beautiful. The pitch looks terrific. The players are ready to get started. And we cannot wait for the contest that lies ahead. One. Oh, shooting chance! Their attempt, just the wrong outcome. A more than decent attempt, Peter. Takes it over to the other flank. It's a promising run he's making on the right. Straight run this, he's covered quite a distance. Pumps it into the area. Alexandro. David Luiz. Well, that's where he wants it. And he's made sure that that won't get through. Well, they can break here. It's the through ball. Has a goal! He's delivered all right! The understanding between those two plays a big part in that, and releasing the run on side proved the key ingredient. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Surprise, surprise, he just keeps on delivering, and listen, we all expect that. Luis plays it out to the flank. That'll be a throw. Looking cross field, changing the point of attack. Some good work on the right flank. Now, what's next? Out towards the flank. It's a decent looking cross. Tries to get it clear. It has got through to him. Marcelo can hoist it clear. Hit into the middle. Has a hit! He's missed, but not by that far. He played it short. Danger averted for now. He's gone out for a throw in. It's Fernandinho. It's Fernandinho! That has certainly tested the keeper. Fernandinho sparked a tremendous stop there, and I think it's fair to add, he just wasn't expecting it. Massive leap! Oh, that was no routine save. William is very sporting here to acknowledge the quality of the save. A lovely little footballing moment. Oh, the clearance is short. Marcelo. Played into the middle. First half is done. So there you have it. A close sport half of football. But it still had its moments. It ultimately produced just one goal. A more than decent game up to now. What do you think we're up to after 45 minutes? 
Well, I think there's plenty to be pleased about with that first half display in terms of the score and, and overall approach. Iran having to have the lead in a tight old game. Half time, 1 0. Already up and running for the second half. Well, 1 0 may be good enough, so they may err on the side of caution and, and get more players behind the ball instead of running beyond it. They could even try to, to spoil it from here, we'll see. Oh, super tackle. They were outnumbered and under the cosh. That had to be spot on, and it was. Put it on the right now. What's on? Looks to dink one in. And the ball is out of play. Casemiro played down the flank he's got options out wide going through Asmu Asmu no mistake and with that goal comes comfort oh, it's a keeper's nightmare Peter he just couldn't pick up on it until it was way too late having so many bodies in front of him Iran have a couple of goals without reply. It's 2-0. Well, at 1-0, this contest was still nicely poised, but now that it's gone to two, mindsets are affected a lot more. Winning belief one way and that losing feeling the other. Marcelo. A real chance to break. Forward it goes. Big chance! And how about the timing of the pass and run? They've worked it before and no doubt they'll work it again. Iran take a three-goal lead and they are romping out of sight. Well, they're very much the better team at the moment, Peter, and, and no doubt will be looking to, to cause even more damage here. Asmoon with a delicate ball. Contest. It is a landslide. Iran are really pouncing on any straight passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heaven. He's made it two, and no doubt he's hungry for more. It's become a case of men against boys. No doubt as to who has the momentum here now. The only doubt is how many is coming. Again, they pile on the misery. Well, I think we've gone past humiliation now. This could be doing some real psychological damage. He's made it three. Quite a day at the office for him. Well, he's been the outstanding player on the pitch and devastating in front of the goal. What a display. What a player. Iran tear their opponents apart once again. They are utterly ruthless. Well, it's been a, an absolutely fabulous spell for them, and they're starting to look unstoppable. There could be more on the way. Just brushed off the ball there, and it's David Luiz. Oh, the ball's come loose! And that's it! Demolition, destruction, annihilation. They simply ran away with it. Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen? Look, we saw some textbook football from White areas that continued to produce expansive attacking play that was ultimately too hard to handle. They were simply too good and 